Hey everyone, Digital David here. Today we're going to be unboxing and reviewing the Viv Image C480 home theater projector. They did send me this item to review, but any opinion expressed in this video is strictly my own. That being said, if you're interested in this item, the link to it will be in my video description below. Please go ahead, check it out, do your shopping from there. It comes in this really nice retail box with great product photography and their branding on it. It's a 1080p projector, can cast a screen from 32 inches all the way up to 100 in 70 inches, 3000 lux for the brightness, so that's gonna be a really nice and bright projector for us. It also has a 40,000 hour LED bulb, so that's a great rating to see in the projector as well. It's gonna last us a very long time. Now let's go ahead and open it up. Here are all the package contents. First up, we got three cables, your power cable, your HDMI cable, and your RCA adapter cable. We have two guides, one's a quick start guide, the other is a user manual with their customer support information on the back. We also have a remote control with full functionality for the projector. You just need to add two AAA batteries. Then we have the projector itself. It looks great. I'm really impressed with it so far. I think that finish is really sharp. I love the two-tone with the polished silver look at the top and your bottom black plastic sides right there looks nice. Got a lens cap for us. We have a quarter 20 thread at the bottom and a nice little kickstand to give it some more adjustments. We can see at the top again, we have your focus adjustment right here, your keystone adjustment right there up to 15 degrees, your touch control panel as well. Then on this side, we can see we have your micro SD card support, your headphone jack, your AV jack if you wanna plug this cable into it, two USB ports and an HDMI port right there. Moving along to the back, we got their logo and a power button as well. And then on this side, you can see where you plug the power cable into. So guys, this looks like a great projector. Excited to get it fired up. Let's go ahead now and plug it in. Setup was super simple for the projector. If you're interested in that projector screen as well, the link to that will be in my video description below. You can go ahead and check that out. You just have to plug in the power cord and then I plugged in the HDMI cord to a computer so we can just watch a quick YouTube video to see how everything works. And what better video to use than my most recent unboxing and review video. So right now we have the volume at less than 40. We'll turn it down some. So the projector's really loud. So that's 20. Let's go down to 10. And at right around 10, I can hear the fan noise again from the projector. So we definitely want to go louder. Let's go up to 50. That's 50. Let's go to 75 now. So I'm really excited to set them up. That means they're gonna be compatible. There's 75, that's super loud. Let's see if we can go any higher, but it'll probably start clipping. Here's the seven and a half watt bulb. It's 75. lumens, has a color temperature of 65. And there's 100 max volume. So that's gonna be a lot cooler light for you. So it looks really nice. It's showing you on this side, it's dimmable, has a timers, remote control, Wi-Fi connection. So you can see this speaker is really loud. You would not have to supplement this with another speaker if you don't want to. Obviously surround sounds amazing when you're doing a home theater setup. So I want to show you really quick while this video is playing. We have that focus control knob right here. So it's becoming more and more out of focus. There we go. It's really blurry and fuzzy. Then we can just turn it back in. And there we go, we're already back in focus. And then they got this great ability to move your screen and rotate it 15 degrees. So you can see now, just depending on your setup or situation, how you want it to be. And then you gotta reset the focus again for it. So now, let's go ahead, let's play some video games on it. All right guys, we got Fortnite up on the projector right now. I'm really impressed so far with everything. Excited to play Fortnite on the big screen. So let's go ahead, let's start this round. All right, the game is about to start. We're having a great time so far, loving it on the big projector. I don't even know what to do, it was so bad.
Roll crawl game. Holy cow, I need a gun. This Tommy gun's not it. Got him. Let's get him. There we go. Dang it. All right, guys, we got the victory royale. The projector was really fun to game on playing Fortnite, so I'm definitely impressed. As you can see from streaming a YouTube video on it to playing Fortnite and video games, I'm really impressed with the quality of this projector given its very affordable price point. Want to point out too, to get the best results, you're gonna want a really dark room. The darker, the better, so you can really see the screen with this projector. If you're interested in this product, the link to it will be in my video description below. Please go ahead, check it out, do your shopping from there. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hit that like button for me. Subscribe to my channel. I have new content coming out daily for you. Also, give me a follow on social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. You can message me on WeChat. Check out our website and join our free newsletter. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please don't hesitate to reach out in the comment section below. I'd be happy to answer them for you or point you in the right direction. Thank you so much, and I can't wait to see you in my next video.